Hello everyone, what's up? This is Rich and this is a quick tutorial on how to hopefully eliminate choppy connectivity with the Juiced client. For those that don't know, Juiced is a uh, internet television. You can get it at juiced.com. It's free. But the uh, issue is, is that the client is kind of wonky in Windows XP, so you get choppy video every so often. It's not necessarily a fault with your internet connections with the Juiced client itself. After reading some message board threads, I found that if you edit a file called tvp-prefs.js uh, and you modify a setting in there, it should eliminate most of the choppiness, and it does for the most part. Um, and by the way, before I continue, this information will be listed in very grotesque detail on the pcmech.com article, which will be linked in the sidebar if you're watching this on YouTube right now or whatever video site you happen to be on. So be sure to go to the article so you can check it out. The file is located in C drive program files, juiced defaults, preferences, and like I said, it's tvp-prefs.js. I'm going to be editing this with Notepad++, but you can edit it with a regular text editor such as just plain Windows Notepad. Let me just go ahead and uh, open that up. Okay, and right around line 83 or 84 as the case may be, the uh, default network HTTP max persistent connections per server is set to 5. The message board thread I read said to set that to 24, and I did, but the thing is it wasn't good enough, so I actually pushed mine up to 50. And it has gotten rid of about 90% of the choppiness in the juiced client which works and if you're asking why do it this way can't isn't there a way to set bandwidth settings in the juice client not really not in windows xp anyway so that you had to edit this javascript file directly and uh, it's kind of scary if you haven't done any text editing before but it's not really that bad what i did also is i commented out the original part i edited by just putting um two forward slashes just in case the, I want to put it back to the way it was before but I haven't had to so uh, that's essentially it you save the file and then you restart the juice client and it should get rid of most of the chop again uh, head over to the PC mech link if you happen to be watching this on YouTube or Rever or wherever you are and it will give very grotesque detail on how to do this because um, it's it's better if you actually have a document instead of watching a video when you're doing this so you have something to reference back to instead of pausing this video and whatever so anyway that's it and uh, it worked for me and hopefully it'll work for you too if you're encountering choppy video and juiced take it easy